I mean, that was kind of awesome. It was super awesome. <laughs> Yo, X Mars Cube, a robotic speed cube. Apparently, it can do some pretty weird, awesome stuff. So, I'm pretty excited to check it out. Who designs this stuff? A cube in a head? What the heck? By the way, the puzzle is $100 on the cubicle.com. That's a lot, but just make sure to use discount code CUPED to get $0 discount. The, the cube is sold out, you cannot buy it anymore, I think. It's sold out everywhere. It's basically a collector's item right now. Maybe I should not open it and it will be worth $1,000. Probably not, let's just, let's just open it up. <laughs> Are you guys ready? Oh, this is actually pretty cool. It's actually a lot smaller than I expected it to be. Here's a normal cube for scale. Wait, it's, it's a lot bigger actually, never mind what I said. <laughs> Ooh, but let's first see what's inside of the box. So we have a cable and we have a quick manual. Well, that's not quick. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> I'm already impressed by the cube and it's not even on. This looks awesome. But before we're going to play with it, um, let's use a second camera because you cannot see what I'm doing right now. Wait, what? Whoa. <laughs> this looks pretty dope, right? I just want to have it on my shelf. This looks pretty cool. So we have purple instead of orange. I think they did that because the yellow looks kind of orange-ish. Is that a word? I don't know. I don't care. There's like this bounce. The noise is kind of annoying though. Okay, let's just do a solve. <laughs> is this supposed to be here? Oh, look ahead is so bad. Okay, that's one pair. Oh, it's here right now. I I'm already getting used to the turning. That was smooth. Oh, let's do a ZBLL. Wait, what did I do? <laughs> that was no ZBLL. Oh, an H perm. I wonder if... Can you do middles? Oh, you can do them. <laughs> that was pretty enjoyable. I'm not going to lie. But what else can you do? Let's just try something. I don't know. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Uh... Wait, what? What the heck is this? Okay, maybe I need to read the manual. <laughs> Alright, so it can do a lot of stuff. Um, apparently, I selected blind mode earlier, so that's why it shut off. But yeah, let's just try some of them. Let's start with 0-2. So I should have, like, some sort of game. I guess we just need to solve it. It doesn't seem to get harder, though. Oh, I guess I ran out of time. That was... Okay. <laughs> so I don't want to go over the learn mode, so apparently it can teach you how to solve the cube, but that sounds pretty useless to me. I mean, who's going to buy this and not know how to solve a Rubik's Cube? Now I want to try out a scramble. It should scramble, I think. Yeah, okay, that was... I guess it's pretty cool. There's one thing that bothers me though. If you just select 3, 1... It doesn't scramble like this, which takes like a second. I, I guess it's cool if you want to flex with your homies, but aside from that... <laughs> this is supposed to be half-blind mode. Oh, so it just shows the centers? Oh, it turns on again. Oh, it's like every other move. I guess that can be pretty interesting. Maybe it's a good thing to practice look ahead. Okay, okay, okay. This can be quite fun. I mean, if you just turn the upper layer again when you're doing F12, then you just see everything again. So I don't know if it's really useful to train. So apparently it shows the time right now. Does it in a weird way? I cannot even read this. 
This is supposed to be like 1 minute 44, I suppose. So the next one I want to try is called Intelligent Dice. Let's give that a try. Why is it taking so long? <laughs> yeah, I guess if you run out of dice. So this one is called Jingle Bell. I don't know what that means. I mean, that was kind of awesome. It was super awesome. <laughs> what was that? I, I guess that's the thing with this puzzle. Like, there's a lot of gimmicks. There's a lot of kind of fun stuff, but I can see myself using this to solve quite a bit because it can be a challenge, but like all the different modes, I don't really know if you need it, but the mode I'm going to show you right now, it's the best out of all of them. I'll show you. Seven, three. Yeah, guys, 2x2 two two Road to World Record is back. <laughs> Actually, I really like this one. I still got it, baby. <laughs> Let's do another solve. Let's do another solve. Uh... Yeah, I just solved this using a two-step last layer. But yeah, um, I don't really know what else to try. It can probably do more stuff than just this, but this, this, this seems to be the most exciting stuff we can do, so... There's one more thing I want to try. Since it has lights, what if there's no outside light? Okay, this is pretty lame. It's still like super bright in here, but it does look... I have to give it, like, it's really enjoyable to turn, it looks cool, I think it's fun to play with, but... $100? Seriously? So I, this was a quick overview of what the cube can do. I will be doing some speed souls, trying to solve it as fast as I can, tomorrow on my Twitch at this time. Just be sure to join them, because the live streams are just so much fun. Here's a small clip of one of them. So yeah, guys, be there tomorrow at this time. Twitch, Cupid, I'll see you there. I hope you liked the video. If you did, please give it one. And if you want to see more of me, just subscribe. Thank you so much. There's only one more thing left to do. <sighs> what do you think of it? Yeah? That's cool. He likes it, guys. Ciao.